Great job, officials. Looking good. Thanks for your help. Thanks for your service to the youth of our communities, of our swimming communities. Outstanding. I see you're all wearing white, so you must have got the memo. That's good. Fantastic. First up will be Connecticut, it looks like, on the swimmers. Thank you, officials. Here come our swimmers. Quick, Squidward will be coming up. We do have that. I had the pirate song going first, right? Connecticut will, right, right. We had it going. You heard it. Gentlemen. Looking great from Wilt, Connecticut. Oh, hats of the meat. The, un the old umbrella hat. I've seen that under the sea. There's Delaware. Illinois. Oh my gosh, you're on the big board. Look at that. Iowa. The Hawkeyes, right? Iowa State Cyclone. And Kentucky Wildcats. All right. Of course, but I was going to make an appearance. It's all New Jersey, right? Yeah. 
dele. Foi Deus. Oh my God, the light bar. Turn that rescue to the YMCA. Ohio! Lots of photography going on here. That's some captains.
How about up there in the stands? Can we get the wave going? It's getting going. Gentlemen, I'd ask that you please rise. Everybody on your feet, please. Now, let's give a huge round of applause to our athletes. Aren't they great? Phenomenal. Woo! Fantastic. Keeping with our tradition, very colorful. And at this time, we're going to remain standing athletes. We are going to have our reflection for this evening. And that will be presented by Kate Ryan, who's a senior for the Powell Crosley Junior Tiger Sharks. She swims up 100 free, the 200 free, and a couple relays. She'll be attending Bettlerman University, and she'll be a knight this fall. So please give your attention to Kate Ryan. Hello, Greensboro. A couple of us may have parents who are officials. I am proud to say that I was my mom's first DQ call. It was my first 200 IM, I was 11 years old, and I would have won my heat if it wasn't for, well, I guess myself, but if I had given up at 11, I would not be here right now, as I'm sure none of us would be. We as swimmers are really good at getting up. Getting up for practice at 4 AM after studying all night, getting up for like six races every day, getting up for our friends to cheer them on, getting on the block and blowing our coaches' minds with our awesomeness. We all know that seeing that lifetime best on the scoreboard is worth every tear shed during practice, every sore muscle, and every bit of self-doubt. And guys, I'm from Ohio. I know I did not suffer through an eight-hour bus ride to come here and be mediocre. We are here to swim like the beasts we are. Promise yourself that tonight, you're gonna get on the block and just go for it. Throw caution to the wind and fight for what you want. Fight for yourself, especially on that third turn. When it gets hard, think of your coaches, your parents, your grandparents, your friends, and draw on them for strength. And never give up, because that would be much too easy. Tonight's swims may be a little scary, just like my first two I am. But we're not gonna be afraid. Tonight, we're gonna embrace that. And we're gonna swim like we never have and never will again. Good luck tonight, everybody. Kate Ryan, motivating us tonight to pay attention and go fast. Please remain standing. Tonight we have a special treat. We'll ask the gentlemen to please remove your hats. As Elodie Mitchell, who's a senior from the YMCA of the Triangle, affectionately known as Yoda, she'll be off to Emory University this fall. And Yasmin Kwong, her teammate, is also a senior. She'll be off to Duke University this fall, where she'll be a Blue Devil. They're going to present our national anthem to honor our country and those that serve to protect our freedoms.
Katie, Alodi, Ashman. Once again, a big round of applause. Hey, we have one more, one more traditional song to be playing tonight. So stick around and stay on deck for this. We all know this one. Big round of applause again for our athletes.
Are you ready? Women's 200 yard backstroke. Championship record 151-27. Set last year by Leah Shackley from Blair. She also holds a national record at 151.21. Also set last year. This will be your B final. Madam referee. Start tonight, great parade of athletes, great swimmers in the pool right now. Lane number one, Claire Pilger from Stevens Point. Tegan McEnroe's in lane number two from Greater Spartanburg. She was 29th in this event last year. Lane number three, uh, Julie Jana Jellick from Birmingham. Lane number four, Erica Maltzev from Greater Somerset County, 20th last year in this event. Lane number five, 12th last year in this event from Schrader, Annie Dickinson. Lane number six, 40th last year in this event from Woodson, Abby Winicki. Lane seven, 28th in the 15 and under event last year from Westport, West and Ella Gustin. And in lane number eight, fourth last year in this event from Fanwood Scotch Plains, Claire Logan. Andy Dickinson out 58.01. The scoring two is 58.67, followed by Claire Logan at 58.58. Logan with 58.00. That's your first 125 completed. So it looks like Dickinson. to the 150 wall, we'll see where she is. He's at 30.71 on the split, 128.72 for Dickinson. He was 130.05 this morning. Claire Logan now moving up. Also down here, it looks like Annie Dickinson from Schrader, 159 to 22, the lead off of the B final, followed by Erica Maltzev and then Abby Winicky. Nice swim, ladies. finalists for the women's 200-yard backstroke. Swimming in lane number one. In 2022 and 2023, she was a B finalist in this event. And she was on the runner-up relay in the 800 free last night. She'll be a Hawkeye this fall at Iowa from Strader, Elizabeth Bean. Out of lane number two, 13th in the 100 back this year. She'll be a lady volunteer at the University of Tennessee this fall from the Lowe's YMCA, Alicia Claiborne. Out of lane number three, 2023 a C finalist in the 100 and the 200 back. B finalist at Winter Juniors, Summer Juniors qualifier. She'll be a Duke at Whitefish Bay University. From Strader, 
Maggie Dickinson. Well, lane number four, our top seed coming in. Fifth in the two back last year, seventh in the hundred back last year. She'll be a bulldog at Yale University this fall from the upper mainline YMCA, Devin Sargent. Swimming out of lane number five, she'll be a wildcat at Kentucky this fall from Greater Spartanburg, Hayden Penny. In lane number six, second in the 100 free last year, sixth in the 100 fly from Wyckoff, New Jersey, Katie Lawrence. Lane number seven, she was 48th in this event last year. From Lakeland Hills all the way back to the final heat, age 14, Vicki Slough. And in lane number eight, last year's 16 to the 200 and the 100 back. She'll be a terrier at Boston University this fall. From the YMCA of Greater Nashua, New Hampshire, Cambry Jewett. <laughs> Madam Referee. Championship final, women's 200 backstroke in the water. Devin Sargent mentioned she was fifth in this event last year. She's out 26-98 tonight. She was 27-64 earlier today. To get the national record, 151-27. Set by Leah Shackley last year. Still your leader is Sargent. They're trying to move up out of lane number seven, Vicky Schluck. Sargent remains your leader at 56.03. She was 56.95, so she's about nine tenths of a second ahead of her pace from this morning. Sargent followed by Schluck. And then down here in lane number three and lane number five, looks like Dickinson and Hayden Penny trying to make a move for that third spot, tightening up between the second and the fifth spot. But Devin Sargent on fire tonight. 125-31 on the board for Sargent. She was 126-73, 156. Trying to get under that 155 point. And it looks like she will be. 154, 63, Devin Sargent, followed by Hayden Penny. And then Maggie Dickinson. Great swim. Wes, well, would you please report to the award staging area? Thank you. Our next event, C final, women's 200 yard backstroke, Madam Referee. Final. 
And on lane number one, uh, Tegan Jeffries, Nashua. Lane number two, Hannah Wenzel from South Y. Lane number three, Amelie Meyer from Piedmont. Lane number four, from Wyckoff, Taylor Leishman. Sophie Perry is in lane number five, wide side of the triangle. Lane number six from Grand Island, Nebraska, Kate Kovinsky. Lane number seven from Birmingham, Avery Anderson. And in lane number eight from Upper Main Line, Audrey Schroeder. Down here in lane at number eight, out in 59.05. So only pretty zipply tonight, Audrey Schroeder. Audrey about a tenth of a second ahead of her pace from this morning. Top 16, 800 freestyle relay, please report on the women's side. Pretty good swim right here. And it is Taylor Leishman going 20204. Real nice by Taylor Leishman. She was 20312, followed up by. Emily Meyer and then Hannah Wenzel. Nice swim, ladies. Our next seat to D final, women's 200 yard backstroke, Madam Referee. We need the 800 freestyle relays on the women's side to the award staging area, please. 800 freestyle relays, award staging area, top 16 teams. Coming in your deep final, women's two back. Adelaide number one from the Greenwich Marlins, Kate Chesley. Lane number two from Lakeland Hills, Lulu Bernard. Lane number three from Greater Johnstown, O'Reilly Cohen. Lane number four from Upper Main Line, Morgan Harlan. Lane number five from Westport Weston, Adriana Spellman. Lane number six from York and York County, Allison Stolford. Seven from Greater Spartanburg, Maricha Ashworth. And in lane number eight from Upper Main Line, Meredith Hummel. Still leading the way, there's Riley Cohen. From Greater Johnstown, sub 1 double O at 59.97. So 50 to go. Still Cohen now moving up, Harley, and then Spellman, center of the pool. by Riley Cohen, followed by Morgan Harlan, and then Adriana Spellman.
Great swim, ladies. Put your hands together, ladies and gentlemen, for all of those backstrokers, 200 backstrokers on the women's side. We'll be presenting our awards to the 800-yard freestyle relay momentarily, and then we will present the awards for the 200 backstroke on the women's side. So we'll go into our awards here momentarily. We've got to have those relays back here. Spirit Squad on Instagram, Spirit Squad 2023 on Instagram, thank you. And if you want to sign up for the AM dance party with the Spirit Squad, do so at section number two. I'll give you a hint, the song so you can practice tonight in front of the mirror I like the way you move, outcast. Presenting the award for the women's 800-yard freestyle relay top 16, the coach from Greater Somerset County, Mary Curry. Finishing in 16th place, Hamilton, New Jersey. In 15th place, Wycombe. 14th place, Lakeland Hill. In 13th place, Piedmont. 12th place, Greater Spartanburg, South Carolina. 
In 11th place, Cheshire, Connecticut. And in 10th place, Greater Monmouth, New Jersey. And finishing in 9th place, Triangle Area, Yoda. Finishing in eighth place, Birmingham Family Y, Michigan. In seventh place, Oshkosh, Big Osh, Wisconsin. Finishing in sixth place, West Fork, Weston, uh, Connecticut. In fifth place, Ben Woodscott Plains, New Jersey. Finishing in fourth place, York and York County, Pennsylvania. Finishing in third place, Upper Main Line, YMCA, Pennsylvania. In second place, Schrader, Wisconsin. And your 2024 National YMCA Women's 800 Yard Freestyle Relay Champions the team of Colleen Bull, Erica Maltzab, and Emotion, Emily Thompson. They were 7, 14, 15, Greater Somerset County. Congratulations to our 800 freestyle relays. Between your champion, Greater Somerset County. Next up, we'll be awarding our 200 yard women's backstroke top 16.
please welcome to the award podium the top 16 from the women's 200 yard backstroke. Presenting the awards, Todd Conrad from Upper Mainline YMCA. Finishing in 16th place from Westport Weston, Ella Gussin. In 15th place from Greater Spartanburg, Tegan McEnroe. 14th place from Stevens Point, Claire Pilter. 13th place from Birmingham, Juliana Jellick. 12th place from Fanwood Scotch Plains, Claire Logan. 11th place from Woodson, Abby Winnicki. Finishing in 10th place from Greater Somerset County, Erica Maltsev. And victorious in the consolation final from Schrader, Annie Dickinson. And finishing in eighth place from Wyckoff, Katie Lawrence. In seventh place from Greater Nashua, Cambria Jewett. Sixth place from Schrader, Elizabeth Beam. Fifth place from Lowe's, Alyssa Claiborne. Fourth place from Lake Glen Hills, Vicki Slough. Third place from Schrader, Maggie Dickinson. Finishing in second place from Greater Spartanburg, Hayden Penny. And your 2024 YMCA National Women's 200 Yard Backstroke Champion with a time of 154.63 from the Upper Main Line Y, Devin Sargent. Again, congratulations to our women's 200-yard backstroke. Your top 16 featuring Devin Sargent, our 2024 champion. The next event Men's 200 yard backstroke championship record set last year 140 47 Daniel Deal from Cumberland, Maryland. Our national record 139 62 also set by Daniel the Real Deal from Cumberland, Maryland last year. This will be your consolation final, Mr. Referee.
And your console final in the water for the men's 200 backstroke. Swimming out of lane number one, uh, Oliver Stone from Greater Spartanburg. Ryan West is in two from Triangle Area. Lane number three, 25th last year in this event for Kanawha, Kenneth McLaughlin. Lane number four, he was third last year in this event from Schrader, Sam Lorenz. Lane number five, 20th last year from McGraw, Ray, Rayburn Cole. Lane number six, 26th last year in this event from Central Bucks, Pennsylvania, Blaze Hoffman. Lane number seven, 18th last year from Greensburg, Peyton Graziano. And in lane number eight from Schrader, John Brostowitz. Wow, center of the pool, Sam Lorenz. As I mentioned, third last year, he's out. 49.50 for Lorenz. He was 51.43 earlier today. For well, Lorenz, big time swim tonight. 116. Wow, moving on, Sam Lorenz. As I mentioned, third last year. So Lorenz was 119 earlier today, followed by Rayburn Cole and Blaze Hoffman having a big swim at 120. But here comes Lorenz. Big job, 142.85 out of the B final. Sam Lorenz followed by Rayburn Cole. And then a big finish by Patton Graziano at a 148. Nice swim, gentlemen. Backstroke, swimming out of lane number one. Last year he won the deep final. He's from the Schneider YMCA in Pennsylvania. Lou Lamb. Out of lane number two. Tenth in the two back last year in the hundred back from Lakeland Hills, Connor Johnson. Lane number three. He was first in this event at long course, seventh at short course last year. Up, He'll be a gold fair in Cal U next year from Greater Somerset County, Kenny Barnacle. Lane number four at top C. He was 36 to this event last year. He'll be a wildcat at Arizona next this fall. From Emmy Lions, Hayden Meyer. Well, lane number five. Last year, six to the two back, third in the four I am. He'll be a Longhorn at the University of Texas next fall. From Boise, Idaho, Tyler Quarterman. Well, lane number six. He'll be a Mountaineer at the University of West Virginia this fall from Birmingham, Michigan, Joey Seven. Lane Seven, 24th in his event last year, and he was on the 800 free relay last night that took first. He'll be a Mountain Hawk at Lehigh University from Ridley, Trish. In and in lane number eight, he was 26 in this event last year from Greater Spartanburg, Jimmy Bisa. Mr. Referee.
So Hayden Myers, our top seed, coming in tonight with 144.51. As I mentioned, 36 in this event last year, center of the pool. Myers going to be an Arizona Wildcat this fall. And now moving up out of lane number three, Kenneth Barnacle at 24.08. So Barnacle was 24-24 earlier today, followed by Myers and then Quarterman. We know Quarterman going big time D1. Bob Bowman just signed up to be their coach. How about that? But Barnacle going to join a couple of his team former Somerset County teammates, the Alexi brothers out there at Cal. This ball, he's out 50.19. He was 51.08 this morning. Ken Barnacle hold off Hayden Myers from Emmy Lyon. And then Tyler Quarterman. Here comes Hayden Myers. Myers, now your leader. He splits 26.55 on that last 50. 117.37. He was 118.10. Myers. Barnacle. Now moving up, Connor Johnson. Your champion, 143.66, Hayden Myers, followed by Kenny Barnacle, and then Connor Johnson on that last 50, splitting 26-17. Great swift. Put your hands together for those finalists, ladies and gentlemen. Nice job. Next up, C final, men's 200 yard backstroke. Mr. Referee. Swimming in your seat final for the men's 200 yard backstroke. Don't forget, championship finalists, beat finalists, please report to the award staging area. Top 16, 800 free relays from last night. Please report to the award staging area, the ready room. Thank you. Top 16, 800 free relays from last night to the awards ready room. Adelaide number one from Upper Mainline, Davis Werner. Lane number two from Kenny Jennersville. Kyle Burke, lane number three from Westfield, Danny Pierce. Lane number four, 21st in this event last year from Central Bucks, Connor Mangan. Lane number five, 22nd last year from Wyckoff, Sam Skibbo. Lane number six from Piedmont, Will Charlton. Lane number seven, 16th last year from Greater Nashua, Dylan Jewett. And in lane number eight, 15th last year from Wilkesbury, Ruby Kupski. So Joe, it's out 52.79. About 7,100 faster than he was this morning. Pretty even field. Sam Skibbo down at 120.80. He was 121.58. Moving up, trying to get under that 150. They are 148, 64 for Kyle Burke, coming back at a 27, 33, followed by Danny Pierce, and then Sam Schimmer. 
great swim there in the C final, gentlemen. Next up, D final, men's 200 yard backstroke, Mr. Referee. And swimming in your D final, men's 200 backstroke. And a lane number one from Schrader, Jude Hill. Lane number two from Woodson, Will Van Ehrman. Lane number three from Greater Somerset County, Lewis. Domingo, Lewis Gotti. Lane number four from Geneva Lakes, Steeler, Wowell. It could be Huwell. Lane number five from the Wilt Y Wahoos, Evan Van Belzer. And lane number six from Wyckoff, Matthew Jun. Lane number seven from Chambersburg, Colin McGraw. And in lane number eight from Birmingham, Benjamin Bricker. Your leader at the 100, that's Jude Hill out in 54.08, followed by Domingo Gotti. And then Evan Van Belzer halfway through. <laughs> Top 16, 800 free relays to the award staging area on the men's side. Looks like Van Belzer from the Wild Wide Wahoos, now 123.13, splits 28.72 on that last 50, now followed by Hill. And then, who will? Van Belzer was 152 earlier today. Now moving up. Here comes Steeler. Van Belzer and Steeler. And it will be Steeler, who will? At a 151. 69. Great swim right there, followed by Evan Van Belzer. And then Will Van Ehrman. Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for all of those 200 backstrokers. Top four heats. Great job, gentlemen. Top 16 relays for the men's 800. Please report to the award staging area. Thank you. to the announcer's table. John Jolly to the announcer's table, please. Thank you.
the championship finalists and the console finalists for the men's two back to report to the ready room. Thank you. Presenting the awards for the men's 800 yard freestyle relays. Top 16, the coach from Ridley, Eric Nelson. Finishing in 16th place, Chambersburg. 15th place, Wilkes-Barre, Pennsylvania. 14th place, the Powell Crosley Jr. Tiger Sharks from Cincinnati, Ohio. 13th place, the Upper Mainline YMCA. 12th place, Triangle Area YMCA, Yota. In 11th place, York and York County. 10th place, Champaign County. And finishing in ninth place, Piedmont, Virginia. Finishing in eighth place, Lakeland Hills, New Jersey. In seventh place, Greater Monmouth. Sixth place, Birmingham, Michigan. Fifth place, M.E. Lions, Cincinnati, Ohio. Fourth place, Greater Spartan. The Cutes. Third place, Schrader, Wisconsin. Finishing in second place, Greater Somerset County, New Jersey. And your 2024 YMCA National Champions in the men's 800 yard freestyle relay. The team of Shane Eckler, Tristan Roney. Jonathan Houle and Jake Kennedy. They were 639-04. The Ridley Area YMCA. Congratulations, gentlemen.
Setting the award for the men's 200 yard max dirt top 16, the coach from Emmy Lions, Ed Bachman. Finishing in 16th place from Schrader, John Abrostowitz. 15th place from Kanawha, Kenneth McLaughlin. Finishing in 14th place from Greater Spartanburg, Oliver Stahl. In 15th place, Ken McLaughlin. 14th place from Greater Spartanburg, Oliver Stahl. 13th place from Triangle, Ryan West. 12th place from the Central Bucks Family YMCA, Blaze Hoffman. 11th place from Greensburg, Patton Graziano. 10th place from McGraw, Rayburn Cole. And victorious in the consolation final from Schrader, Sam Lorenz. Time of 142.85 for Sam. Finishing in eighth place from Schneider, Luke Lamb. Seventh place from Ridley, Tristan Roney. Sixth place from Greater Spartanburg, Jimmy Beeson. Fifth place from Birmingham, Joey Stebbins. Fourth place from Boise, Idaho, Tyler Quarterman. Finishing in third place from Lakeland Hills, Connor Johnson. In second place from Greater Somerset County, Kenneth Barnacle. And your 2024 YMCA National Champion for the men's 200 yard backstroke with a time of 143.66 from Emmy Lions, Hayden Myers. Congratulations, gentlemen. set here last year from Blair, Pennsylvania. She also holds a national record at 50.60 set last year in December. This will be your B final, Mr. Referee. Tonight, 21st last year, Emily Ray, 7th, 
She's out in 25-24. Versakis was 25-54. And heads for home. And it will be your winner in the final. Billy Surratt going 54-68. Followed by Lady Mitchell and then Claire Versakis. Great swim, ladies. finalist for the women's 100 yard butterfly. To be down in lane number one, she'll be a lion at Columbia University this fall from Wyckoff, Isabel Lee. Lane number two, 10th in the 100 fly last year from Lakeland Hills, Anna Kilponen. Lane number three, She'll be a Cavalier at the University of Virginia this fall from Greater Somerset County, Anna Moosh. Lane at number four, fifth to this event, 2023, part of the runner-up relay, the 800 free relay last night from Schrader. She'll be a Cardinal at Stanford this fall, Alana. Berlin. Swimming out of lane number five. Second in this event last year, both at short course and long course. So be a Cardinal at Stanford also this fall from Greater Somerset County, Emily Thompson. Lane number six. She was 59th in this event last year. She's from the Pocono Family Wives in Pennsylvania. Cynthia Luniacina. Lane seven. 3,800 free relay. She'll be part of the Crimson at Harvard this fall. From the upper main line, why? Kenzie Padilla. And in lane number eight. She'll be a war eagle in the fall. Go Tigers. At Auburn University from Westport Weston, Kate Murray. Mr. Referee. Butterfly Championship Final in the Water. And it's Thompson ahead of Berlin. And most Thompson at 24 11 tonight. She was 24.91 earlier today. Emily Thompson, Greater Somerset County, can she hold off the field? And she does, she goes 51. Wow, big drop tonight, 51.47 for Thompson. Great swim, followed by Berlin and then Moshe. Put your hands together, great swim right there for Emily Thompson in that championship final.
Our next event, C-Final, women's 100-yard butterfly, Mr. Referee. Final now in the water for the women's 100 fly. Last at our championship finalists and B finalists, please report to the awards ready room. Thank you. Lane number one, Eva Tuvalekis. Lane number two, Addy Hirschbrunner. Lane number three, Aziza Meyer. Lane number four, Eliza Osada. Serena Dickies in five. Sophia Luane in six. Ava Knopf Snyder at seven and Corinne Everly in lane number eight. Aziza Meyer out first in 25-32. She was 25-77 earlier today. Here comes the field trying to move up out of lane five is Serena Dickey. The winner of your seat final will be Serena Dickey. She goes 55-42. Coming off from a 56-49 earlier today, followed by Meyer and then Osada. Great swim, ladies. Next up, our D final. Women's 100 pound butterfly. Mr. Referee. Swimming in your D final. Out of lane one, Lily Phillips. Lane number two, Madison Upton. Lane number three, Janice Yip. Lane number four, Abby King. Lane number five, Amber Gallimore. Lane number six, Baron Benoit. Lane seven, Ellie McNamara. And lane number eight, Adam Berlin. Leader at the 50, Gallimore, 25-97 going out. She was 26-52 earlier today, followed by King. And down there in lane number one, Lily Phillips. Chester rams up. Great swim. Put your hands together for all of those C and D finalists, and we'll be awarding the top 16 here momentarily. We need our top 16 for the women's 100 fly to the ready room, please. Thank you.
presenting the awards for the women's 100-yard butterfly, the coach from Greater Somerset County, Mary Corey. Finishing in 16th place from Cheshire, Kylie McHire. 15th place from York and York County, Emily Way. In 14th place, from Farmington Valley, Aaron Richards. Finishing in 13th place from Fanwood Scotch Plains, Laura Kim. Tied for 11th from Greater Somerset County, Victoria Castro, and from Upper Mainline, Claire Rosakis. Finishing in 10th place from Triangle Area, Alodi Mitchell. And victorious in the B final tonight from Fanwood Scotch Plains, Billy Sherrod. <laughs> Finishing in eighth place from Wyckoff, Isabel Lee. In seventh place from Lakeland Hills, Anna Kilponen. Sixth place from Upper Main Line, Kenzie Padilla. Fifth place from Westport Weston, Kate Murray. Finishing in fourth place from Pocono, Vicenia Lunis Sheena. Third place from Greater Somerset County, Anna Mosh. Finishing in second place from Schrader, Alana Berlin. And your 2024 YMCA National Champion for the women's 100-yard butterfly with a time of 51.47 seconds from Greater Somerset County, Emily Thompson. Congratulations, Butterfly championship record 46 10 set back in 2019. Brendan Burns from the upper main line YMCA and your national record set back in 2023 44 67. Thomas Heilman from Piedmont. This will be your consolation final, Mr. Referee. Swimming in your console final on lane number one, Evan Tack. Lane number two, Roman Torres was 63rd last year. Lane number three, Ezra Herring was 39th last year. Jack Mills in four of six last year. Ethan Vance, fifth, 56 last year's in five. Sebastian Aguilar, 21st last year's in six. 
Jimmy Beeson in seven, and Kai Batchelor in lane number eight, out first. Ethan Vance from Jefferson. And Vance, he was 22.46 this morning. 21.85 tonight. Here comes Vince, 47-85 out of your B finalist, Ethan Vance from Jefferson City, followed up by Jack Mills and then Jimmy Beeson. Nice swim, gentlemen, great job. Time to meet our championship finalist and 100 yard butterfly. So we're gonna lane number one, 60 to 50 free last year, fifth and 100 free, 38th in this event last year. From the YMCA of Indiana County, Pennsylvania, Preston Kessler. Lane number two, 19th in this event last year from the Farmington Valley, Connecticut Y, John Rusna. Lane number three, seventh in this event last year. He'll be a Jaguar at IUPUI this fall from the Racine Family YMCA in Wisconsin, Hugo Ortega. Well, lane number four, your top qualifier tonight. He was third in this event last year. He'll be a Texas Longhorn in the fall from Greater Somerset County, Garrett Gould. Swimming out of lane number five. Eight last year in this event. Was part of the 800 free relay champions last night. Part of the Fighting Irish next ball at Notre Dame from Ridley, Shane Eckler. Adelaide number six. He'll be part of the Wise at Youngstown State University this fall from DeKalb County in Illinois, Jacob Grammer. Lane number seven. The C finalist of this event last year. From Schrader, Brody Lepine. And in lane number eight, from Piedmont, Will Brown. Championship finalist, 100 Butterfly, Madam Referee. Your championship final in the water. Derek Gould, third last year, is your top seed coming in. He brought Shane Eckler also. And lane number five. We'll see where these guys are compared to their morning trips. Gould was 22 22 33 this morning. Eckler was 22 34, so only 100 separated that. But here comes Jacob Kramer, 21 76. He was 22 04. Kramer only two tenths off a national record pace. And it will be Garrett Gould coming back in 25, 49, going 47, 29 for Garrett Gould, followed by Jacob Kramer. 
and then John Rusta. Great swim, gentlemen. Next event, C final men's 100 butterfly, Madam Referee. Coming in your seat final, Aiden Williams in lane one, Aiden Gould in lane two, Chase Grissy in lane three, Ed Stoltz in lane four, he was 25th in the 1500 free last year. Lane number five, Axel Lori, 77th last year, Charlie Reddits in sixth, Damian Sartoreski in seven, and Patrick Gibbons in lane number eight. And a winner of your C final, it will be Charlie Renner, 49-19, followed by Hayden Gould, and then Axel Mori. Nice swim, gentlemen. Next up, D final, men's 100-yard butterfly, Mr. Referee. Swimming out of lane number one, Will Waiwahu, is Tommy Lucier. Lane number two, Birmingham, Quinn O'Neill. Lane number three, Birmingham, Ethan Zhu. Lane number four, Redding and Berks County, Owen Eisenhofer. Lane number five from Chambersburg, Amir Tasker. Lane number six from Geneva, Colton Clark. Lane seven from Countryside, Owen G. And in lane number eight from Upper Main Line, Connor Kirby. It's Kirby out first at 23-15. Coming up on the D final, 15 and under, pretty tight race. And it will be uh, Amir Tasker going 50.18. Great swim, Amir, followed by Colton Clark. And a tie for second, Owen Eisenhofer. Put your hands together for all of those 100 flyers on the men's side. And we want to have our top 16 report to the ready room. Thank you.
All right, please welcome our top 16 to the awards podium for the men's 100 fly. And presenting the awards for the men's 100 butterfly top 16, the coach from Greater Somerset County, Mary Corey. Finishing in 15th place, Sebastian Aguilar, Oshkosh, Wisconsin. In 14th place from Lakeland Hills, Kai Batchelor. 13th place from York and York County, Roman Torres. 12th place from Jackson Community, Ezra Herring. 11th place from Greater Spartanburg, Jimmy Beeson. 10th place from Lynchburg, Jack Mills. And victorious in the consolation final from Jefferson City, Ethan Vance. Finishing in eighth place from Indiana County, Preston Kessler. Seventh place from Piedmont, Will Brown. Sixth place from Schrader, Brody Lapine. Fifth place from Racine, Hugo Ortega. Finishing in fourth place from Ridley, Shane Eckler. Third place from Farmington Valley, John Rustock. Second place from Kishwaukee, Jacob Kramer. And your 2024 YMCA National Champion for the men's 100 yard butterfly with a time of 47.29 seconds from Greater Somerset County, Garrett Gould. Madam Referee. And a new women's 200 yard breaststroke console final from Cheshire in lane number one, Julia Barto. Lane number two from Piedmont. She was 17th last year, Cameron Smith. Lane number three from Lowe's. She was 36th last year, Amelia Betancourt. Lane number four from Upper Main Line, 12th last year, Hadar Miller. Lane number five from Upper Main Line, 25th last year, Paige Fisher. Lane number six from Greater Spartanburg, Caroline Byers. A lane number seven, 14th last year, this event from Racine, Mac Thomas. And in lane number eight, from Birmingham, Kelly Hassett. B final in the water, 200 yards of breaststroke for the ladies. So Hadar Miller from Upper Main Line, 12th in this event last year, teammate right next to her, Paige Fisher, 25th last year. 
Fisher at 105.20, 100 through. She was 105.69. Miller was 105.68 earlier today. Teammates and training partners trying to move up now. Out of lane number two, here comes Cameron Smith. Cameron was 17th last year from Piedmont, but it's still Fisher at 140.83. She was 140.76, so she's going to pick it up a little bit. Here comes Smith. Smith was 141.43 at the 150. She was 141.96 earlier today. Smith, Fisher, Miller. Fisher, your leader, and it will be Paige Fisher in your B final, followed by Cameron Smith and then Julia Barto coming back in 36 24, takes third in the B final. Nice swim, ladies. Time to meet our championship finalists for the women's 200-yard breaststroke. To be down lane number one, 14 years old, from Piedmont, Megan Ayers. Lane number two, seventh in this event last year, third in the 100 breast last year. She'll be a Commodore at Vanderbilt University this fall from Fanwood Scotch Plains, Emily Constable. Elaine, at number three, third in this event last year from Greater Spartanburg, Grace Hunt. Lane number four from Piedmont, Sarah Zierjak, our defending champion. Elaine five, fifth in this event 2023 from York and York County, Molly Yakoviello. Coming out of lane at number six. Fourth to this event last year, she'll be part of the Harvard Crimson this fall from the Chippewa Valley, Wisconsin YMCA. Gabby Augustin. Lane number seven. Eighth to this event last year was the long course champion in 2022 in the 200 breaststroke from Butler, Pennsylvania, Giona Lavarini. And in lane number eight, tenth in this event last year, she'll be a Laker at Grand Valley State University this fall from a rapid area, Michigan. Elliot Michael Pine. Madam referee, Madam referee. Championship final for the women's 200 breaststroke. Yeah. The water defending champion, Sarah Zierjak from Piedmont, center of the pool. Next to her, Molly Yacoviello from York and York County, as I mentioned, fifth in this event last year. And Yacoviello takes the early lead at the 50. She's out 29 74 for Yacoviello. 
She was 30.34 this morning, followed by Grace Hunt and then Gabby Augustine. So Yacoviello. And her dad a few years back sang the national anthem for us. Pretty tight right there, Yacoviello, Searjack, and Hunt. Only 28 hundredths of a sep separating the three. So 10305 for Yacoviello. She was 10441 earlier today. Still, Yacoviello. Can she bring it home for the York and York County ladies? 136.84. She was 138.75. Just over national record pace. Yako Viello, Sirjek, and then Augustine, and it will be Molly Yako Viello just over the national record 210.87, followed by Sarah Zirjek, and then Gabi Augustine. Great swim, ladies. Molly Yacoviello going 210 tonight. Beautiful. Next up, C final women's 200 yard breaststroke, Madam Referee. Swimming in your seat final women's 200 yard breaststroke. Out of lane number one for McGraw, Vanya. Kajorkovic. Kajakovic, I'm sorry, Kajakovic from McGraw. Lane number two from Indian Valley, Josie Nimsek. Lane number three from YMCA Greater Nashua, Izzy Gilbert. Lane number four, 19th in this event last year from Upper Mainline, Grace Curtis. Lane number five from Champaign, Babette Bradley. Lane number six from Piedmont, Allison Bendall. Lane number seven, 40th last year from Indiana County, Peyton Scott. And then lane number eight from Greater Monmouth, Eve McGinnis. Moving up on the halfway mark in our C final. Out of lane five, Babette Bradley. She's at 106, 22. Splits 35, 34 on that. Babette Bradley was 106, 32 this morning. Right on pace, on the number. So Bradley, still your leader from Champaign County. Now moving up, Grace Curtis. Curtis, Bendel and Scott, McGinnis all in it. Trying to chase down the Bet Bradley. 143, double zero. She was 143.36 earlier today. 149.95. Heading for home in your seat final. Now moving up, Grace Curtis. Down here in eight, also McGinnis. Seven is Peyton Scott. She goes 219.03, followed by Curtis and then McGinnis. Great seat final, ladies.
Next up, D final, women's 200 yard breaststroke, Madam Referee. D finalist, lane one from Woodson, Lexi Glenicki. Lane number two from Wyckoff, Josie Marino. Lane number three from Northwest North Carolina, Skyler Zulega. Lane number four from Lakeland Hills, 12 years old, Alexia Davies. Lane number five from Woodson, Scout McQueen. Lane six from Rapid Area, Addy Hine, lane seven from Upper Palmetto, Lila Hadley, and in lane number eight from Greater Spartanburg, Claire Burns. D final, in the water out first, Skyler Zulegger. Now moving up out of lane number five. Scout McQueen, 106.24 for Scout. She was 106.96 earlier today, being followed by Zuleger. And then Alexa Davies now moving up in lane number four from Lakeland Hills. Up on the 150, still Scout McQueen. She was 143.95 this morning, 142.61 tonight. Followed by Davis and then Zuleger. Presenting the awards for the women's 200 yard breaststroke top 16, the coach from York and York County, please welcome John Nelson. Finishing in 16th place from Birmingham, Kelly Hassett. 15th place from Racine, Mac Thomas. 
Tied for 13th from Greater Spartanburg, Caroline Byers, and from Lowe's, Amelia Battencourt. In 12th place from Upper Mainline, Hadar Miller. 11th place from Cheshire, Julia Barto. Finishing in 10th place from Piedmont, Cameron Smith. And victorious in the consolation final from Upper Mainline, Paige Fisher. Finishing in eighth place from Piedmont, Megan Ayers. Seventh place from a rapid area, Elliot, Elliot Meckelpine. Sixth place from Butler, Yona Laverini. Fifth place from Fanwood Scotch Plains, Emily Constable. Fourth place from Greater Spartanburg, Grace Hunt. Third place from the YMCA of the Chippewa Valley, Gabby Augustin. Second place from Piedmont, Sarah Zierzak. And your 2024 YMCA National Champion, for the women's 200-yard breaststroke with the time of 2.10.87 seconds from York and York County, Molly Yakoviello. Congratulations, ladies. Our next event, men's 200-yard breaststroke, championship record set in 2018. Max McHugh from Door County, 153.59. Our national record set back in 2021, 151.39 for Matt Fallon, Somerset Valley. This will be your consolation final, Mr. Referee. Console final in the water for the men's 200 breaststroke. Lane number one, 33rd last year, Evan Hepburn. Lane number two, 41st last year for Greater Somerset County, Gabrielle Beverini. Lane number three from Lynchburg, 21st last year, Thomas Fenton. Lane number four, 13th last year from York and York County, Caden Fada. Lane number five, 44th last year from Schrader, Jack Paul. Lane number six, Braden Franklin from Greater Spartanburg was 28th last year. Lane number seven, he was 57th last year, getting all the way back from Regional Wide Western Connecticut, Bobby Regan. That's a brother swimming in this meet a few years back. And in lane number eight, Seth Morgan, 67th last year from Rocky Mount. North Carolina out first Jack Paul 57.99 going out for Jack.
He was 58-54 earlier today. Center of the pool. Here comes Caden Thought, who also up there in lane number one. We still have Paul, then Hepburn, then Fada. Paul at 129.60. He was 130.20 earlier today. Heading for home, gonna be too close to go. Followed by Evan Hepburn and then Braden Franklin. A nice swim, gentlemen. Time to meet our championship finalists. Coming out to a little steely Dan tonight. Out of lane number one, 23rd in this event last year. He'll be a Tiger at the University of the Pacific this fall from Greater Monmouth, New Jersey. Dante Dentino. Lane number two. Seventh in this event last year, 10th in the 100 press, 14th at the 2 IM last year. He'll be a Pitt Panther this fall from Indiana, Pennsylvania, Alex Bauer. Lane number three, third in this event last year. Be part of the Fighting Irish at Notre Dame this fall from Birmingham, Michigan, Angus. McDonald. Lane number four, our top seed coming in. 13th in this event last year. He'll be a Bearcat at the University of Cincinnati this fall. From Yoda, John Reese Taylor. Lane number five. Fourth in this event last year, second in the Hunter Press last year. He'll be a Buckeye at the Ohio State University in the fall from Jackson Community, Ohio, Luke Vickers. Lane number six, ninth in the two breast in the spring last year, and he won this at Long Course last summer. He'll be a Badger at the University of Wisconsin this fall. From Oshkosh, Wisconsin, Drew Gareth Hofner. Lane number seven, 18th in this event last year from Birmingham, Michigan, Patrick McKillop. And in lane number eight, two-time champ in the long course 4IM, from Lakeland Hills. He'll be a blue, Duke Blue Devil this fall. Owen Markowitz. <laughs> Mr. Referee. John Reese Taylor, as we mentioned, first time championship finalist in this event. We'll see what happens tonight. Angus McDonald, Luke Vickers, either side of him. 
He's out 2603. He was 2677 earlier today. John Reese Taylor. Give him a hoot, give him a holler, he's going by. Fifty-five oh five for Taylor. He was fifty-six sixty-eight this morning, followed by Vickers and then McDonald. Twenty-nine oh two on that last fifty for Taylor. He was twenty-nine ninety-one on that fifty. He was thirty fifty-five earlier today. Keep your eye on McDonald. Looks like he's cruising. 125, 49, almost two full seconds ahead of his pace from this morning. Here comes John Reese Taylor, McDonald trying to make a move. Seventy-two, followed by McDonald and then Luke Vickers. Great swim for John Reese Taylor from Yoda. Nice swim, gentlemen. Next up. The C final men's 200 yard breaststroke. Mr. Referee. Just working on a couple touch pads. Get ready for our C final. Men's 200 breaststroke in the water. Coming out of lane number one from Wyckoff, 22nd last year, Michael Grennan. Lane number two from Pal Crosley Jr., the Tiger Sharks, Cooper Stenkin. Lane number three from York and York County, 54th last year, Christian Henry. Lane number five from Upper Perky Omen, 17th last year, Kai Hang. Lane number five, 31st last year, this event from Upper Main Line, Jake Mwazriat. Lane number six, from Birmingham, Charlie McQuiston. Lane number seven, from Randolph, Aiden Ochoa. And then lane number eight, from Pocono, Carter New. Down here, lane eight, that's Carter Mew from Pocono Family out of 58-58. He was 59-61 earlier today. Big swim tonight. See if we'll be able to hold on. Still Mew up here in lane number eight. Trying to move up, center of the pool. Kai Hong. 
but it's still Buell at 130.69. He was 132.40. Push it for home. Carter Mew, Pocono. Can he hold on? Outside smoke. He was 205.66 this morning, tonight he's 203.11. Carter Mew, followed by Michael Granin, a lot of outside smoke there. And then Kai Han, great swim for Carter from Pocono, Pennsylvania. As to their top 16, please report to the ready room. Men's 200 press, top 16 to the ready room. Thank you. Next up, D final. Men's 200 yard press stroke, Mr. Referee. Once again, top 16 men's 200. Breaststroke, please report to the ready room. In the water, your D final. Men's 200 breaststroke, Adeline One from Greenwich, Evan Rip. Lane number two from Butler County, Adrian Labrini. Lane number three from York and York County, William Reese. Lane number four from Birmingham, Nate Stebbins. Lane number five from Greater Spartanburg, Finn McEnroe. Lane number six from Cheshire, Neil Alejandro. Lane number seven from Laurel East Hartford, David Korzenowski. And then lane number eight from Cheshire, Braden Hale. Out first at 19 coming off a 30-33 split, Nate Stebbins. <laughs> Stebbins was 1-0-43 earlier. A tenth of a second faster tonight. Brown Evan ripped out there in lane number one. He is ripping it. Still Stebbins, then Rip, then Reese. Here in your 15 and under D final. 133.26 for Stebbins. He was 133.38. So 2200 to the second quicker. Looks like Nate Stebbins could take this D final. And he will. Great swim tonight in a 206-22, followed by Evan Rip. And then William Reese, senior D final. Nice swim, gentlemen. Put your hands together for all of those 200 press strokers. Ladies and gentlemen, on the men's side. Nice job. We'll be presenting the awards to the men's 200 press truck, and then we'll get ready for some relays. Finish up those medley relays tonight that we started yesterday. How we doing up there tonight, fans? You doing all right, swim fans? Good job. Hear you loud and clear down here. Appreciate you attending tonight. Got a little more Steely Dan coming up here.
And presenting the awards for the men's 200 yard breaststroke, the coach from the YMCA of the Triangle area in Raleigh, North Carolina, officially known as Yoda, Jamie Bloom. Finishing in 16th place from Lynchburg, Thomas Fenton. Tied for 14th from Greater Somerset County, Gabrielle Beverini, and from Regional Y Western Connecticut, Bobby Regan. In 13th from Rocky Mount, Seth Morgan. 12th from Schrader, Jack Paul. Finishing in 11th from Greater Spartanburg, Braden Franklin. In 10th from Triangle Area, Evan Hepburn. And victorious in the Consolation Final from York and York County, Caden Fata. Finishing in eighth place from Oshkosh, Drew Gareth Hofner. Seventh place from Greater Monmouth, Dante Dentino. Sixth place from Birmingham, Patrick McKillop. Fifth place from Indiana County, Alex Bauer. Fourth place from Lakeland Hills, Owen Markowitz. Third place from Jackson Community, Luke Vickers. Second place from Birmingham, Angus McDonald. And your 2024 YMCA National 200 yard breaststroke champion for the men with a time of 157.72 seconds from Yoda, John Reese Taylor.
minute, one minute. Stick it to our timeline. Are you ready for some reading? Women's 200 yard medley relay, your national record, 128.53, set back in 2021, championship record, set back in 2022 by Piedmont, 128.95. Sorry, that was the men's. This will be your B final. Mr. Referee. Pretty zippy tonight already. 200 yard medley relay, B final. Now first, Natalie is at Jackie, 26-12 in that 50 for Cheshire. Followed by Spartanburg. <laughs> On the breaststroke, 54-84 for Spartanburg. One one hundredth off their time from last night. Still Spartanburg at 120.38, Green Everly. Right on their number from last night, 120.88.
Here comes the Sea Dogs. But Spartanburg in your B final. They are 144 13 with two to the Lakers on the anchor, splitting 23 75. Followed by Yoda and then Westport Weston. Great swim. Next up, championship final, women's 200 yard medley relay. Madam referee. Once again, your championship record, 139.09. Also, your national record, set by Schrader uh, last year. Pretty zippy backstrokers going out. Very even field. Emily Thompson, sub 25 and a 24.73, followed by Dickinson. For Schrader. <laughs> Under national record pace. <laughs> Band with Scotch Plains. Great split for Constable. 28-34, 53-37. Just over the national record pace. Wow, 22.97 for Elena Berlin. Schrader at 116.80. Just over national record pace. We'll see what they can do, bringing it home. Andy Dickinson, 16 years old. Just over the national record, but Schrader, they take the two medley, followed by Greater Somerset County with Anna Moshe on the anchor, 21-23. Followed by Fanwood Scotch Plains. Great swim, ladies. Please report to the award staging area. Next up, the men's 200-yard manly relay. Championship record 128-63 set by Schrader yesterday. And your national record 126-25 set last year in December by Piedmont, Virginia. This will be your consolation final. 
Mr. Referee. swim there by Johnson. He was 2358 earlier today. Followed by Umley. And then in Jackson community. Keep your eye on Jackson community at 2494 by Lou Vickers, just coming out of the two breasts. Oh, and Markowitz in the water for Lakeland Hills. Here comes Michael Ferrolioli. Still Jackson County. Lane seven. Daniel Ham on the anchor, and it will be 131.05. Jackson Community Y, followed by York and York County, and then Lakeland Hills. Nice swim, 20.38.1971 for Wilkes-Barre's Noah Powers. I swim, gentlemen. Next up, championship final men's 200 yard medley relay, Mr. Referee. Triangle and one with West, trip back in two for Fenwick Scott, Clay Kennedy and three for Ridley. Lapine in four for Schrader. Barnett for five for Greater Somerset County, Myers for Emmy Lyons in six, Devins in seven for Birmingham. And Van Irving for Woodson's in eight. And it's Kenny Barnett go out 22-23, just over the record pace. Followed by Schrader and then Ridley. <laughs> Breaststroke is red. Paul was 25-21 earlier today. He's 25-45, 47-94, just over national record pace. So it's Schrader, Greater Somerset County, and then Birmingham. He flyers away. Schrader, 20.80. 108.74, just over 
National Championship record pace. Can Trader top it from last night? They got 128.60, 128.85. Then Ridley, and then Greater Somerset County. Great swim. We'll hand out those awards here momentarily on the women's and the men's 200 medley relay. Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for all of those medley relays. Great job. Greater than Ridley, then greater Somerset County. and our guys to please report. Guys, relays, please report to the ready room. Thank you. And presenting the awards for the women's 200-yard medley relay to coach from Schrader, Dave Anderson. Finishing in 16th place, Rapid Area. In 15th place, YMCA Chippewa Valley. 14th place, Champaign County. Thirteenth place, Greater Monmouth. Twelfth place, Cheshire, Connecticut. Eleventh place, Westport, Weston, Connecticut. 10th place, YMCA of the Triangle Area, Yoda. 
and victorious in the consolation final, Greater Spartanburg, South Carolina. Finishing in eighth place, Lakeland Hills, New Jersey. In seventh place, Piedmont, Virginia. Sixth place, York and York County, Pennsylvania. Fifth place, Lowe. Finishing in fourth place, the upper main line wide. In third place, Fanwood Scotch Plains. Finishing in second place, Greater Somerset County. And your 2024 National YMCA Women's 200-Yard Medley Relay Champions, a team of Maggie Dickinson, Amy Hu, Alina Berlin, and Ann Dickinson. They were 139-26, Schrader, Wisconsin.
Right of your 200 yard medley relay top 16 on the men's side finishing in 16th place Reading in Berks County wide Pennsylvania in 15th place Wyckoff New Jersey finishing in 14th place Wilkes-Barre Pennsylvania Finishing in 13th place, Crater Spartanburg, South Carolina. 12th place, the Upper Main Line YMCA. 11th place, Lakeland Hills, New Jersey. Finishing in 10th place, York and York County. And victorious in the consolation final tonight, Jackson Community YMCA. Finishing in seventh place, Woodson YMCA. In sixth place, Baywood Scotch Plains, New Jersey. Fifth place, Birmingham, Michigan. Fourth place, the Triangle Area YMCA Yoda, Raleigh, North Carolina. Third place, Greater Somerset County, New Jersey. Finishing in second place, the Ridley Area Rays, YMCA. And your 2024 YMCA National Men's 200-Yard Medley Relay Champions with a time of 128.85, the team of Brody Lapine, Jack Paul, Sam Lorenz, and Jack Sullivan. Schrader, Wisconsin. Congratulations to all of our athletes tonight. Thank you, officials. Thank you for attending. We'll be back here to start tomorrow morning at 8.45 with our reflection and anthem and a few other announcements. Don't forget to sign up for the fan face-off over there at section two with our spirit squad. I think that'll be featuring Coach Jerry Foley next year.